Emergency crews are now on the scene of a deadly two vehicle crash in Malden, West Virginia. Deputies say several other people are critically injured. 13 News reporter Lily Bradley is live for us tonight on the scene. Lily, what's the latest? Pat, Jennifer, this is still very much an active scene here along U.S. Route 60 near Malden. Now, the Kanawha County Sheriff's Department has confirmed that two people have passed away and four others were critically injured. Now, again, a very active scene with me. I'm joined by the Assistant Chief of the Malden Fire Department, Bradley Scott. Thank you for being here. Still very much an active scene, right? Yes, ma'am. This time, uh, law enforcement, they'll be doing their reconstruction. Probably take about three hours. So uh, both east and westbound lanes are out. 60 will be remaining closed till that time. Now, one lane of 60 is open on the eastbound, right? What do you say for drivers coming through? Ask for a bit more caution, right? Yeah, they need to slow down coming through the area, and actually, they can get off at the Malden exit and go on uh, old Route 60 of Malden Drive to uh, Midland Drive, and that, that will take them on up to Bell, and they can get back on Route 60 at the uh, DuPont underpass. Now, the westbound lane still closed and will be for quite some time. And the eastbound lane is going to remain closed also. Okay. Thank you very much for joining us. I really do appreciate your time. Again, guys, very much an active scene here. Both of those lanes will be closed, for, so for drivers coming out, be extra cautious as you're heading out and about in this area. Now, this is a developing story, and we will continue to update you both on air and online as more information about this crash becomes available. For now, reporting in Malden, Lily Bradley, 13 News, working for you.